All right, on with the show. I know everybody likes cards, so we're going to do a little bit of card magic here. This is my favorite card trick because it's easy to do because it only uses one card. I get really confused when there's more than one. Anyway, um, I've got this card and it's got one spot on the front. See that? One spot. And on the, on the second side here, it's got four spots. And here on the third side, it's got three spots. And here on the fourth side, it's got six spots. What is the shoes? You all look pretty confused. I'm going to show you again. There's one spot on the first side, four spots on the second side, three spots on the third side, and six on the fourth side. That's only five. That's only five. That's right. No, there's six. You don't see six spots? No. I wouldn't know why. I don't know. There must be something obscuring the sixth one. Anyway, um, because you've been a good audience, I'm going to show you exactly how this one works. So, You're going to reveal yourself. This is a very rare thing. Magicians aren't Revelation. supposed to do this. Yeah. But I'll tell you, one spot, there's only one spot in the first place. There's two spots here. And I just cover one of them with my hand. Right. It's the same thing with four. You see? There's really... So that's how I set up the second half. Because then I turn this over, and I got the same two, but I'm covering up a non-existent spot that's not even there. <laughs> see that? That's clever. And then when I do six, it's the same thing. But... Everybody always says to me, okay, so what do you do when someone says, okay, now move your hand? And one answer is, okay, well, you just act like your hand's not there. But you can always just move your hand and show them the spot. That's, that's the other option. Same thing with three. You can just show them that there really are three. Of course, if there's three spots on this side, can anyone tell me how many spots are on this side? One. Three. Oh,